everyone a warm welcome and a heartfelt namaste to one and all today i wish you all a very happy navratri season and may the goddess bless us with bountiful navratras are the time in our life when we transit from one season to the next we transit from the spring to the summer in the navratras of the chaitra masam and we transit from the rainy season or the autumn to the the winters for the sharad navratras this is a season when our body requires a lot of adjustments and by praying to the goddess keeping fast for the goddess this becomes a easy transit for us all as a chapter in our lives closes a new one begins and today we begin a new chapter on our journey we start off with a session on q and a that is a quiz session and an interactive session if you all are willing to participate a quiz where there is no rights and no wrongs just an interactive session so that we can see how much we have progressed in our knowledge of astrology and nakshatras in particular so as the moon transits ashlesha nakshatra today today we have and quiz on ashlesha sundays are the times for relaxation and so when the mind is relaxed it runs better moon in ashlesha gives us the energy to think on terms of ashlesha and we can have a great output so let us move with ashlesha nakshatra today what is who is the deity of ashlesha nakshatra well the deity of ashlesha nakshatra are the nagas the nagas are supernatural uh creatures creatures beings who have huge amount of powers under their control they are skilled in various art forms they are skilled in many a things and they have the ability to shape shift that is they can take the shape of the organism the being the entity they wish to take many of them have this power the nagas are also entities who guard a particular treasure in the tales of the yor it has been said that when a treasure was buried underneath we could always locate a serpent that is a, not a serpent actually a naga um which is which is a, which is a kind of or you know it's a genre of uh, the serpents so it could be found nearby in the vicinity guarding that treasure such that only the rightful owner could get the treasure no matter what the time period descendants if they happen to be the rightful owners could also get access to the treasures but none other those who tried to forcibly pursue those treasures were left dead and wanting so this is the nagas and the nagas one more beautiful characteristic is the nagas strike at the right time in the right place they very quiet very calm very deceptive but they do not ever go wrong when they have to get back at people when we talking about planets so let's move on to the planet we talking about venus here today venus is one of those planets that gives in plentiful being the ruler of the second and seventh house of the natural zodiac it connects us to the family and to the public at large being a planet of love generosity and arts skilled in arts of all kinds it is also a planet of creativity venus is the eternal doctor because it gives the ability to us to revive others right from the near the mouth of death venus is also all about singing music art dance craft so many things venus is a ever generous ever helpful planet when we talk about the third house the third house is the house of siblings friends creativity oratorship our ability to you know perform well and it also shows our strength it shows it also shows our um a beautiful life ahead and it shows our ability to do good with others 
and to take the lead. It shows the leadership qualities in us to the maximum. So when we put all of it together, we get Venus as the Lord of the third house in Ashlesha Nakshatra. The question today for all of you here is, how would Venus as the Lord of the third house in Ashlesha Nakshatra perform? This is an interactive session. The more we interact on this platform, we would be able to gain a lot of knowledge. Assessment is beyond uh, our preview. We can only take a guess as to what can be the right answers. We would also, as we continue along the series, if we do find an interactive audience, we will definitely make it worth its while by introducing prizes at one end surprise gifts at one end. So please interact. Please make it a beautiful show which can be carried on in the future. With that in mind, thank you. Have a nice Sunday.